top floor, hardware, menswear, and portals. All these science spheres are made of asbestos, by the way. Keeps out the rats. Let us know if you feel a shortness of breath, a persistent dry cough, or your heart stopping. Because that's not part of the test. That's asbestos. Good news is the lab boys say the symptoms of asbestos poisoning show a median latency of 44.6 years. So if you're 30 or older, you're laughing. Worst case scenario, you miss out on a few rounds of canasta. Plus, you forwarded the cause of science by three centuries. I punch those numbers into my calculator, it makes a happy face. Man, if there's two things I love in this world, it's smiley face calculators and asbestos. I want to stay in here. It's safer. Uh. Okay, let's move on with this thing and see where... Okay. Obviously, I gotta get up there. Football stadium lights, some bleachers. I feel like I should have an audience. Tell the unreeling. You cannot tell me what to do. We've established this. Okay, let's yeah, let's go up there and get a better look. Wait, what's that? Aha! It's something I can portal onto. All right. We got a stairs, catwalk, and leads to nothing. Great. Hmm. Yeah. Oh, here we go. All right, and in we go. I like your style. You make up your own rules, just like me. Bean counter said I couldn't fire a man just for being in a wheelchair. Did it anyway. Ramps are expensive. <laughs> I agree, ramps are expensive. Okay, well, what do we got here? Okay, alright. Splash. Okay, let's try throwing some goo up there. It's in my eyes. <laughs> okay. Uh, there's the exit. Um, no walls I can portal onto. Um, oh, I can make it over there. I think. Yeah. Oh, oh wait, I didn't want to do that. Oh, come on. That was moved far enough away. Ah, it's in my hair! Okay, what do we got around this corner? Not much. Uh, okay, I have to get over there. Uh, let's try flinging some goo over there, see what happens. I, th I think I have an idea. Uh, yeah, there we go. Oh yeah. Just a heads up, that coffee we gave you earlier had fluorescent calcium in it, so we can track the neuronal activity in your brain. There's a slight chance the calcium could harden and vitrify your frontal lobe. Anyway, don't stress yourself thinking about it. I'm serious. Visualizing the scenario while under stress actually triggers the reaction. All right, more goo. Surface over there to portal onto. No walls to now, stick it on Now, if you're part of control group Kepler-7, we implanted a tiny microchip about the size of a postcard into your skull. Most likely you've forgotten it's even there. But if it starts vibrating and beeping during this next test, let us know. Because that means it's about to hit 500 degrees, so we're gonna need to go ahead and get that out of you pretty fast. All right, so this room has a shower in it. Um, 
do on the ceiling. I don't know if that really helps my cause. It seems like that water washes off all the blue stuff. Oh, let's get up to that button. And that, uh, oh, it turns off the water. Okay, so with the water gone, I can shoot blue goo out there. It starts up again. Okay, so I have to... Um, yeah, I had to bounce up there, hit the button. Uh, nope, hit the button. Hit the button! There we go. Now portal onto that. Goo shoots out. And I bounce up. Ha! Nice, even got to be... Even got to do a play-by-play -play on that one. I'm telling them, keep your pants on. All right, this next test may involve trace amounts of time travel. So, Sweet. word of advice, if you meet yourself on the testing track, don't make eye contact. Lab boys tell me that'll wipe out time. Entirely. Forward and backward. So, do both of yourselves a favor and just let that handsome devil go about his business. Okay, so, little goo droplets on the wall. Okay. Um, see about putting some goo droplets up there. That is less than helpful. Let's just spray goo everywhere and see what happens. Nothing! That did... diddly. Okay, can't reach. Um... Okay. Think, 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 think. It didn't work either. Ah, let's try from up there. That might give me the boost I need. Oh, wait, wait, no. Oh, shoot. There we go. Now, uh, let's put a portal there. And jump into the blue one. Perfect. Okay, I've got a big room in the sky. This is accidents hurt. You you will be hurt. Coworkers, don't endanger others. The company. Replacements are costly. Science. Investigations and <laughs> be progress. That's awesome. Okay, now, um, hmm. Let's see. Hmm. Okay. Let's take a look from over there, see. If anything else pops up. Okay. Uh, well. Okay, let's try popping out of there. Ah, uh, crap. Okay, get back up there. Try this again. Okay, so I want to fly out of there. Nothing up there to latch onto. Oh. Why does it throw me into this? Oh! Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Plan for me. I need goo. Where can I get goo? Oh, I, oh yeah, I remember. There's goo back over there. Come here, blue goo. There. Yeah, let's put the blue goo there. Perfect. Now let's fly out through there again. Perfect. Uh, 
there's nothing here. Well, what the hell? There's nothing up here. Oh. Uh, okay. I see. If you're hearing this, it means you're taking a long time on the catwalks between tests. The lab boys say that might be a fear reaction. I'm no psychiatrist, but coming from a bunch of eggheads who wouldn't recognize the thrill of danger if it walked up and snapped their little pink bras, that sounds like projection. <laughs> they didn't fly into space, storm on the beach, or bring back the gold. No, sir, we did. It's you and me against the world, son. I like your grit. Hustle can use work, though. Now let's solve this thing. Okay, so we got Grandpa Cube in a box. Let's fill him with goo. Oh, sweet! <laughs> wow, Grandpa Cube is a badass. I'm gonna try and catch that thing, don't I? Come here, come here, come here, come here. Come here. Oh, come here! Ah, let's clean you up. Get that blue shit off. There we go. Okay, now Grandpa Cube, can you give me a boost? No, you can't. Damn it. Okay. Now, can this get high enough to get me up there? There goes a Grandpa Cube again. Um, nothing. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Grandpa Cube is off his mitts. Let's wash him up. There you go. Okay. Let's figure this out. Okay. Just. Covered in glass. Do I have to throw Grandpa Cube out there to break the glass? What does this do? Any? Oh, that lowers the elevator. Okay, now I feel retarded. Again. Alright, there we go. Now bounce up there. Okay, now go. Ah, oh, shit. Uh, Grandpa Cube, move. Try to hit him with the blue goo. Come on, get him, get him, get him, get him. Ah, there we go. Science isn't about why. It's about why not. Why is so much of our science dangerous? Why not marry safe science if you love it so much? In fact, why not invent a special safety door that won't hit you on the butt on the way out because you are fire? Now you test subject, you're doing fine. Yes, you. Box your stuff. Out the front door. Parking lot. Car. Goodbye. Jeez, Cave, tell us how you really feel. 